used it, but he just, um, man, I'm going to say it wrong now. Something broke, oh, water pump. He put in a new water pump the other day, and when he did, he accidentally messed up the radiator. So he put radiator fixer stuff in there and put the radiator back in, but I missed the whole process. So anyway, here we are. He's letting it run or do something. I don't know. Not even going to pretend to know. Look, I'm going to mic you up. You might regret that. What? <laughs> Is it still hot? It's all going to be hot. Oh. Don't let Give me a rag, please. Okay. Here. Huh? Don't let it splash in your eyeballs. Thanks. Sure it is. I didn't touch it. How often do you change it? How often? Well, I mean, it ain't like it gets a lot of miles. Well, it's just old. So, I'm trying to take care of it because other people, I'm sure, did not. Why do those tires look so flat in the front? Maybe they need air. I need the, uh, there's an oil filter wrench on the uh, shelf over there. Yeah. It's come right here. Six of them in there. All, all, like all of it, all of it? Six. There's only six ports. Put all six ports in there. You say so. Don't make a mess. <laughs> really? You sure they gave me the right stuff? Next day we're going to do is put valve cover gaskets on. Not today, but it will come. I don't even know what that is. Put a big filter on here to help keep oil cool because. Do I need to, to pour some low. in the filter? No, it's going to drain down in there. Last one. My lips are chapped. Chapstick? Yeah. You know I'll be carrying it. Hit me. I don't want it. You know what trash is? I don't want it. Woo! They don't look like there's no oil in there. Huh? They don't look like there's no oil in there. You're not supposed to see it from there. Okay. When you get finished, don't get it all over the motor. Okay, you should have told me that. Put it back where you got it and stick the leg back on it. The cap's right there.
Hey, will you do me a favor? Look, grab a marker, whatever the mileage is. Just write uh, whatever the miles are. No, not here in the windshield. Whatever 3,000 miles are above whatever it is. Whatever 5,000 is, so it'll be... You told me 3,000. 3,000. It'll be 35 something. 30, 745. 330,000. No. Well, that one don't count. Oh, I thought that was a lot of miles. <laughs> oh, my God. Now I'm even more confused. Okay. Forget the three. Forget the five. Add 3,000 to that. No, those four-digit numbers right there. It will be three... 30,575. 3575. No. 30. I still don't think that's right. I never said math was my strong suit. I don't know why you're so special. Because now I'm, I got it where it's only, there's only a three digit. Should be five digits. Yeah, it's not. It's only four. I don't know. When did your door get so dented right here? I really don't think it had anything to do with me. It's been like that? I think so. I've never noticed it. I was gonna put it in. Foxy. You better hope you can open it back. <laughs> True. But it's all on this side, so you're good. Is that too loud? A little. Huh? A little. Is that too loud? A little. I wanted to shut it. Bite that, or is it? Chew it up good. Can you finish what you got in your mouth? But Hank, be nice to your mama on Mother's Day. You can be a brat. Hey, quit being a brat. Ah, boy! Don't make me come in there. Don't make me come in there. One. Last one. Here. Good girls. Hey, quit being a turd. I'm sorry, did you want some too? Oh, you can sit like a pretty boy? There you go. That's a good boy. Chew it up good. Went and got me some plants at the store. I didn't, I didn't grow any marigolds this year. I, I accidentally dropped these upside down when I got them out of the car, so they were all broken off. But I got these to plant between my tomato plants because I didn't plant any. And then, whoa, big spider, sorry. Um, and then I got some basil that because I, I didn't start that from a seed. And this is, what is this? This is, it's pretty in flower bouquets. Thai basil. I like to put it in flower bouquets. It has these pretty little purple flowers. Do not come over here to eat my plants. Y'all gonna get on my nerves. Anyway, oh, and I got these. I love this stuff because you just can it. And you don't ever have to water it. It just thrives in the summertime. It's called Mexican Heather. Except this is just called Heather because I guess they took 
the word Mexican off and I don't know if I was supposed to say that or not. Anyway, that's what it used to be called. Okay. I swear, if y'all eat this stuff, I'm going to be so mad. All right. I got them planted. Now I need to go get my leaf blower and blow all that mulch back in. Look at all these freaking ants. I have stepped in a pile of ants. They got my ankles, but look at them. Oh, I can't stand them. I'm gone now. All right, now I'm gonna plant, I'm gonna plant these over there in my herb garden. Get out of the way for a second. Okay, excuse the weeds. Um, let me tell you something. So I got tomatoes planted right here. I've never planted them here before. I think I'm just going to use the fence to kind of trellis them. Um, whatever, maybe. Anyway, and then behind them I planted a row of peppers. They're looking a little weak. But let me tell you, I started all my peppers and all my tomatoes from seed. And I started like a few different varieties of each. Just saw my first Japanese beetle. Um, I planted a few different varieties of each. And so, anyway, I didn't label them like I should. I got all mixed up. And now I got all these tomato plants and all these peppermint plants. And I don't know what's what. We got Roma tomatoes. We got cherry tomatoes. We got um, some Cherokee something or another tomatoes jalapeno peppers bell peppers different kinds of bell peppers might be a banana pepper in there a cayenne pepper i don't know all i know is we'll find out when they start growing one two three four five six seven eight i did exactly eight while i was running my mouth and i didn't even count how cool is that all right these guys are look a little weak but they'll be all right <sighs> You gotta be careful when you buy these little packs because sometimes one of them little holes don't have a flower in it. They try to get you. Y'all hear them guineas squawking out there? I lied the other day and told somebody that guineas ain't noisy because my guineas hadn't ever been noisy. But these new ones we got just chatter all the time. These poor things, they'll be all right. I can't believe I dropped them upside down. Okay, now I'm gonna introduce y'all to this little guy and tell you who he is, why he's here, how he got here. Okay. Whoo! I got up too fast. Okay. It's hot today. Come on, little buddy. Let's introduce you to everybody now that we know you're staying. Hold on. Okay. Now. Look at all this goose poop on my porch. Ants. Okay, Linwood, let's introduce you to everybody. Boy, you so dirty. This is Linwood. Have you been eating dirt, son? <sighs> Linwood has been here since April 1st because I thought Linwood was an April Fool's joke. Um, a family member found Linwood the evening of april 1st <laughs> and anyway couldn't keep him i'll show you a picture of what he looked like when he showed up compared to what he looks like now get out my um hydrangeas now don't be messing them up anyway linwood was skinny and homeless family member found him 
out and about and brought him to my mama's house. She found a rescue that was going to take him and then long story short she fell in love with him and she kept him. But oh Rudy just body slammed him. So if you can see got those little red things in the corner you need water hold on pause let's go get water if you look at Linwood's eyeballs he got something called he's got something called cherry eye it's where them little little middle pieces get I don't know whatever anyway go get some water bud I don't know what kind of life he had before but he is absolutely terrified of everything you don't see that now because he is a normal dog when he's around Rudy. That's the only time he's normal. Any other time he's like in the corner. Now the geese are coming to steal Rudy's pool. <laughs> he's having surgery for his eyes next week. He's also getting neutered next week. The vet estimated him to be when we found him, which was April 1st, um, a month, a month, five months old. So he's a little dude. Um, aren't you little dude he's gonna take some work he wears this long lead because he's so scared of everything if something scares him he won't come back to you right now we're still working on training so he wears this so if something scares him and he bolts I can step on it but we'll get around to not having to wear that granny's got that um, collar a little loose don't she buddy here let's go get some water come on come on Get some water. You don't have to get in. Just drink some. Drink some water. Here. Drink some water. big old booty splashing out all the water. I think the geese are chasing Rudy. Why'd you pull the thing out the pool, boy? Don't let them steal your pool. You stand up to them geese. 